Now I want to step further. Welcome to Greybeard's channel. This is Greybeard. Uh, yeah, I want to step further and striped it up here where this moves with the the uh, fender. I figured I'd strike that too. Anyways, I hope you like this chan. I mean this video and uh, and the channel. Uh oh, she just died on me. Hopefully we can get it started back up. But anyways, I hope you like this channel. And if you did, please hit the like button, subscribe, hit the no notification bell, and share the crap out of it. Let's get this ride going. Hopefully. There we go. never had it just dial me like that let's take it Manhole cover. Let's take the old route. Funny, this car was uh, going slow for the 35 zone, and now they're doing well. Actually, they're down to 25 now. Took them a while to slow down, I guess. <coughs> it's 75 degrees here today. I've already felt a few bugs tinging me in the face. I doubt it'll stay green long enough, but let's hope it does. It did. Can't believe it. Usually I get stuck at that light just about every time. There's the chucho. Yeah, that avenue I always take there that I just got off of. It runs along the tracks. Of course, these two towns kind of run along the tracks. Seems how they're in the valley and so is the uh, train tracks. Not much choice there. I'm just glad I got riding shades. Yeah, if you go to riding, a pair of shades will help, but you want ones intended for riding. They have the little gasket-like thing that goes around the back side of the lens frame. It'll let in a little bit of air, but it keeps most everything from coming in with it. Oh, uh. 
like my turn signal you really don't have to on this turn because it's actually the same road even though it goes around a 90 degree corner there it's weird as long as i've been here going on 20 years now and i still try to turn my turn signal on Well, the sun ain't as low today. I got out a little earlier. And see, like I say, I'd be at 26 by now. I was able to get up the 30 there without speeding too much so when it dropped down to 28 that would have been 26 because I'd only been at 28 to start with I'm not trying to gun it all the way kind of regulating with the throttle It's a little over the speed limit, but not by much. It's 25 all the way up to somewhere around that bus there, or van, whatever you want to call it. And just past that, it goes to 35, not long after 45. It might actually go straight to 55, I'm not sure. Yeah, 35 right here. If I had a little more oomph, I'd already be doing it looking truck it's beautiful out today never took you out this way since I got the uh, rover boss switched out Let's see if we can uh, do better than uh, 39 going this way well, it starts downhill right up here. Oh, no, actually, it goes back uphill to the bridge. That's right. We'll see. We will see. Thirty-nine. Let's see what happens on this other hill. I doubt it. No, didn't even get thirty-nine. Did hit 39 on that first part of the hill. Get up the end of this park, we'll look to see how close to 41 we hit. So I had it zeroed out. That is the peak so far. The beautiful mountain. See, I just went through a dust cloud and minimal dust in my eyes hardly any at all i did feel it somewhat though regular shades wouldn't have stopped any of it i'd have had all kinds of dust in my eyes this is a pretty park even the entrance is pretty I can't wait to see, you know, after some mods, how well it goes up through here. 
course we will take it up other hills too. with the way it climbs up through here though especially after stopping at that stop sign This little road looks wore out already, but uh, it ain't that old. It's 15 years ago or so, actually a little more than 15. Yeah, about 15, I guess. Yeah, uh, a little more than 15. <laughs> Anyways, this all used to be, uh, or that there that we just got off of where that loop is was all dirt, and this was grass. I used to have to weed it up against this fence all around where the big mower couldn't get and mow little spots. Another guy ran the big mower. Remember that path almost went up at one time? Can't even try to go up it now. Skirt. Probably won't do this anymore this year. Going around this little area here. Get more leaves down through here and it might become a little sketchy more so than normal bumpity bump 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 that felt odd when I gunned it almost like the uh, belt went all the way loose and you know I wasn't I was already moving so there was like a little slack in the belt that took it a second to, to zing up and catch. pretty though I wished it showed up as well on camera as it does when you're looking at it you know with the naked eye oh I forgot let's see how see if we went faster than we have before the spider wants to live on my uh, uh No, 39.27. We went faster than that a couple times. Now I got spider web on me. That must have just recently happened. I might have did that one went around the, that little narrow pathway. Because I don't remember seeing these. It's weird. There's a line there and a line there. I don't remember seeing that before. But anyway. Yeah, sometimes when we're hitting bumps, it's this you hear jiggling there's a joint there that lets you spin it you know sideways or whatever and it's as tight as it can go because i tried to tighten it up before i took off but it still has that jiggle it's just something you live with when you're cheap you used to have speed bumps there at that little intersection I remember when we put them in <laughs> people would come zooming up through there some of them hitting another gear as they go through the intersection with a four-way stop <coughs> <coughs> anyway uh, <laughs> this one old guy he was looking dead at us we were sitting over here by the, the bathroom area <coughs> behind the bathrooms is where we park all the equipment and uh, he was he was looking dead over that way 
<laughs> with his scowl on his face because he, <laughs> he was gunning it up through there as usual yeah he didn't like it too much it was funny his speed limit going up through there is only supposed to be 15 to start with that guy come up through there probably doing at least 30 35 through a four-way see if we can hit that 34 we had the other day without the hill behind us because we stopped there you know, at the low point 32 33 i think we'll hit it maybe even 35. not maybe close but not quite Yeah, I imagine this thing may go as fast as 45 without the uh, rev limiter pulled out. It just don't have the power to do it quite yet. I think the biggest thing will probably be the car. Get a car with a little bit bigger jets. I, w I do want to see what it will do without the rev limiter pulled because like going down that hill just then and the, the, the most I ever did was 39.62 and I still didn't hear no rev limiter. You can hear it when it hits it. You can tell it's like G -g 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 -g. So like I say, we're almost flat. Maybe a hair downhill, but not by much. And it took it a while to get from 30 to 36. But it'll hit 37. Possibly 38. Yep. We got 38 just for a second. Oh, we're at 25 now. Slow it down. Hardly a cloud in the sky. I'm doing almost 10 over and I got a heavy duty truck coming up on me. got that big truck off my butt now we see what this thing does at it take off going up his little hill it's a little mini the little mini I would have to kind of walk it up this hill a little bit that's the difference a torque converter makes. But like I say, this thing don't have the power that little mini does. But it has the advantage of the torque converter. Oop. I don't 
remember that bump feeling that rut. I usually dodged it and just didn't pay attention that time. Yeah, you get down in these big shady areas and whoo! Like I say, it's 75 out, supposedly. And uh, you hit these big shaded areas. Even right here, I can feel it. It's like it drops down 10 degrees real quick. Maybe even more. So I'm getting a little bit of a chill. Don't know what that van was about, but they had caution lights. Or their hazards on, anyway. Yeah, I wish they'd pave a lot of these roads. I always think it looks cool when you got all them little skinny trees lined up like that. It knocks the noise down. Although you're probably not getting a whole lot of noise on this little road. Plus it gives you privacy. Can't beat a good old picket fence though. Hopefully it's a little easier to see the video now. Put the sun up a little higher. Like I say, there used to be a restaurant there to the left where that parking lot is. And, uh, you used to have some pretty good food there. I'm big on burgers and they had a pretty good burger. Pretty darn good. that noise and I took the top case off heard it just then kind of to me it almost sounds like it's probably something to do with the variator and I know it can't be that uh, I've heard people talk about where the belt rides up too high on the pulley I wouldn't going as fast as this thing's went before so I know it couldn't have been that just then yeah uh, yeah I was doing about 26 28 nah I've been 39 on this thing before so you know the belt would have had to been riding up higher then I'm hearing a squeakiness too Let me, uh, actually put this on the mechanic stand. Nice close-up of the mirror. And maybe old blue. Not hearing it now. Maybe it has something to do with having a load. Er. I might need to check the air in the tires, but that tire feels fairly good. I ran over some glass or something right before I started filming. Yeah, I might just get me a flat black paint marker and just dab that. For now, I think it'll look all right. As long as it matches the flatness of that. Yeah, if you see the sun hitting it, you can probably see how reflective it is. But anyway, I'm gonna go ahead and end the video here. And uh, I hope you liked it. 
I like watching rad videos myself. See if I can get this thing. Yeah, this thing, you don't have to worry about it falling out because it's hard as heck to get out when you're trying. It's, it's halfway out and it gets stuck and you have to reach up in there and pinch the little doohickeys. I even got spider web on the camera. And hopefully, the camera was clean enough. I didn't think to wipe it. <laughs> but anyway, so don't forget to like, subscribe, hit the notification bell, and uh, share the crap out of it.